Jim, unfortunately, a 3-1 defeat today. Yep, not good enough. Nowhere near good enough. First half, coming in at 1-0, we were, we were decent. Slow start, but we, we gradually played our way into the game and got the goal. Second half, we just didn't come out. A couple of set pieces we conceded from today, is that something that needs work on? <laughs> the boys were told about it. We give them the information before the game. Uh, we give them the information at half time, uh, and then they score from, from two corner kicks, which is extremely disappointing. First one, we don't clear line. Second one, we all stand and watch and, and leave it for everybody else to go and deal with, uh, and it's not acceptable. Uh, like I say, we, we, we told the boys before the game and at half time again, uh, we knew where their dangers were going to be, and, and we didn't deal with it. On a more positive note, yesterday we announced Dylan Boyle as a signing. What do you make of him? Dylan will come in, you know, uh, probably disappointed he didn't play today, but he need to get his, his match sharpness up and, and train a wee bit more with us uh, before before that comes up. But yeah, it's it's pleasing to get to get Dylan in over the line. But unfortunately today's result takes the shine away from that and unfortunately you can't think too much about it. Next game is home to Cliftonville next Saturday. What are your thoughts on it? Listen, we'll have to, to come in now on Tuesday night, we'll dust ourselves down. We'll have a lot of preparation that needs done and a lot of work needs done after today. Uh, and we will have a look at things for, for Cliftonville next Saturday.